Hey everyone, this is Bella. Um, today I'm going to be drawing um, a flamingo. I got this from Mayu on how to draw. So thank you Mayu so much. You taught me so much. You're my inspiration. So I hope you like this video and comment others. Alright, first you need to start with the beak. You have to draw a line like that, well a curve, and then come in, do another curve, and then like that. So it's going to look like this, if you can see. Alright, now we're going to connect that by going in. in like that. So, you can draw any, you can erase anything you don't like, like little stray marks. Alright, so if you could see that, that's great. So, now you have the beak. You have to draw a circle like that, like, because flamingos have this little, I don't know, part of their beak that's like black or whatever. Now you want to draw the little nostril, which is just a little dot. And then the little smile, because you want the flamingo to be happy. Alright. And I will color this in with Sharpie so you can see it better. So, um, here we go. Now the head. You want to go in like this. Draw like little feathers like that. So it shows that he has like feathers. And then in like that. Do you see that? Alright. Now, you need to come in like this to make a little cheekbone. And now, you'll have to draw the um, eye that May you drew. It's like this. But I change the eye. I just go like that. And then you just bring it down. Because she does a side and then whatnot. So you can watch her video too. Alright, now the body. You want to bring it in like this and go in you want to make the body small and before we connect anything we want to do the wing you can just go like that and then connect what you think of it now you need to draw like some ruffle feathers so like on his chest like that now the legs. You need to draw two line, well, curved in lines, and then straight down lines. And then you want to draw the big feet. And then the other one. You go like that, that, draw the big feet, and leave that little space there. And then to show that it's bending, draw a little line that's going in. Alright, so that's the flamingo. Um, I will turn him around for you guys to see it better. So it's like that. Alright, now I'm going to color him in. You need, well, a yellow and a black Sharpie, um, definitely. So make sure you have those. Alright. So I'm going to outline everything I just did. So do that. So then you'll see it like popped out more. Okay. You can also do this with um, any black marker or whatever you prefer. I just do this for it to stand out more. Um, Them in. Now the other leg. 
So again, thank you so much, May You. You taught me everything I know. Um, so now let's color in all the black parts. So this little part is black. So let's just color that in the black. And then you want to color in the eye. He's going to be a really cute flamingo. Alright, so that's all the black. Now we are going on to the yellow. We need to color this part yellow. Make sure you don't get the black because then it'll like smudge and be a little gross. Um, so yeah, you have to be really careful about that. So I'm going to color this all in. Oops. Like so. And then I'm going to do the legs. So let's color this in, color in, color in. So. And um, I also do other ones. Like one of my other favorites is um, like the hummingbird, the peacock, the cat, and so on. So that's that. And now we can color in the body. You can use um, any of these colors. These are all Sharpies. You can use other markers, crayons, colored pencils, pastels, anything you want. Alright, so I'm probably going to color it. So yeah, you can do any color you want. Um, I'll pick a red. Alright, let's color this little guy in. So, yes, um, you can do designs on him, like, you can do anything you want, really. So, yeah, that's that. He's gonna, and he's a very happy flamingo. So, I'll make other videos for you guys, um, and this is all dedicated to May You, so... Please, thank you. And, um, so yeah. Just call this little guy in. And you can skip through this part if you want, because it might take a little. And you can, like, usually flamingos are pink, but I, I do them pink sometimes, but I need to get new Sharpies, because mine are running out. I love drawing this is like my passion like whenever I have my free time I do this it's a great um it's great it's a great thing to do like I feel like it just expresses like your feelings and whatnot um so yeah this is like drawing um sort of lets me be free and like express what I want to because you can draw anything anything in the world so. and so far he looks like this um, I have some better ones, trust me. <laughs> this is just a quick one. Um, so yeah. Let's get this buddy. Um, so yeah, I have other drawings that I will show you. There's your little flamingo! And for the scenery like the background you can get like a green put some grass and there you go and this is called Phoebe Flamingo so there 
box. A little guy. So I hope you liked this video. And um, here are some of uh -oh, my other drawings that you might like. So I have my diamond flamingo. See the little diamond on his forehead. I have another flamingo with like a design on his wing. Um, <laughs> I wrote like a little chibi thing rules. Um, yeah, a blue feathered flamingo, baby flamingo. Um, a peacock that came out really bad. A hummingbird that didn't really come out that good either. And finally a cute little mustache. Mr. Mustache, I call him. So I hope you liked this video. Um, please comment and, and like. Uh, um, so thanks for watching. Bye.